Boy, so it's 2.17 in the afternoon. On this whole trip, I've never seen Brad like sleep in that late and he's been drinking like a fish too. So we're a little fucking worried. He's probably just snoozing. Brad! Fuck it. Oh, what the fuck? Where is it? Bro, this shit's not even here. What the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? Is that blood? It looks like it. Maybe he's on his period. Brad's trans if you guys don't know. That's weird about that blood. Brad's filmers here, Jake. We'll ask him. Uh, no. I noticed I, he posted a story on his Instagram this morning saying he's leaving. Like, left where? Left back to LA, home. Wait, he posted a story? Texas is awesome. I'll miss it for sure. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing here. He just left you He just left me now that I think about it. We're gonna ask around. Yeah, that's weird. That's Let me weird. know. Okay. How long have you been filming for Brad? Um, I've been filming for Brad for about four months now. So how did you find out he was leaving? I found out through his uh, Instagram story. I don't even know why he wouldn't tell us in person. He's too big of a pussy, so I'm stranded here, which is cool because I kind of want to be part of Full Send. I don't really care about Brad Martin or BM Fit gear. So TJ, what are you currently doing for work right now? I work for the boys. They hired me as a chef, you know, like it's amazing, we're on tour. Did you see Brad at all last night? So I saw that girl coming out at like Wait, Brad. what girl? A girl, like a random girl, like. So he was with a girl? Yeah, she looked traumatized. She sat by me and she was about to cry, you know, and she was really shaky and I was wondering, you know, like what was going on? What, what, what happened? Okay, we're gonna FaceTime Brad right now because he just typed in our group chat. Hey, Yo, what's good? Yo, where Yo. you at? Where are you at? Yeah. Did you leave? Yeah, I'm in the airport. What airport? The LAX. I just landed at LAX. What about Jake? He's still here. Jake's, he got a later flight. That's I'm not, coming back, though. That's not what I'm he said. Jake's. Oh, yeah, okay. That's fucked up what you did. What did I do? Are you sure it's not because of the fucking blood on your what bed? What are you talking about? The blood on your bed? It's just weird, because we see some blood on your bed, and then all of a sudden, it just looks like you're escaping town. You guys are stupid, bro. DJ said something about a fucking girl being fucking traumatized after leaving your room, oh. so. It's just not matching up. Well, we're gonna get to the bottom of this, so we'll talk to you soon, I guess. I don't know, it could be anything, really. How do we know this girl's? Where's this girl? I think we gotta find this girl. That's what we gotta do. So for this interview, you've chosen to remain anonymous? Yes. So I guess tell us about last night. Well, I, I came to party with the Nook Boys and Brad was here. We were taking tequila shots and playing flip cup. You know, one thing led to another and I was in Brad's room. And I don't know, we started fooling around and while we're like fooling around, he reaches over and like goes into his dresser drawer and pulls out a heroin needle and asked me if I wanted to shoot up. I said, no, thank you. And he was like, fine, I'll just shoot up myself. And as he was shooting up, blood just like went everywhere, like all over the sheets. I felt super uncomfortable and I had to leave. I'm seriously traumatized by that, I will never forget it. So has Bradley contacted you since? Yeah, he keeps tagging me in gym memes on Instagram. Okay, this is this has been really helpful, I appreciate it. Thanks, thanks for coming by. Thank you. What's up, boy? What's going on? Good. Welcome. Wow. You guys want to blow some stuff oh, up yeah. there? Oh yeah. Let's do it. Boys, got some fucking chew in your lip or what? Uh, I got, got some Nick 6. Got some Nick 6. Yeah? I don't know what the hell that is, but put it in. I think around here you gotta wear this hat for outwards. Gotta let them know. I can fish. Oh, I can God. tow any of them. Oh, that's the car? Yeah. Oh, shit. What do you mean by blowing it up? Uh, we're gonna build it. Four pounds of tannerite and a bunch of gas and you just... Yeah, gasoline, and tannerite. <laughs> I used to date a girl named Tannerite. <laughs> That's all I know. Oh man, this is what we did growing up. You get a fucking field car for 200 bucks and you have fun for like 24 hours and then you burn it. <laughs> Ow! Ow! I can't have anything nice. Hey, this is a really weird angle. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> what? Are you alright? They came through? Come on, fuck, bro. When I saw him going, I'm like, I'm hitting the gas, he knows, right? <laughs> Here we go. You look like Chewy. Oh, oh. <laughs> you good? Oh, I popped my knee on my plate. Oh, it happens sometimes. Fuck me. Oh, fuck, motherfucker. Oh, 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 fuck. I tried to do a wheelie. <laughs> my leg went on the ground, and then all my weight went on it, and it twisted in. 
Fuck, boys, what time is it? It's not even noon. I'm already fucking put out. Oh, More fucking stunts for you, bud. Yeah, I'm getting old, boys. Alright, boys, so today we're with our boy Rob. We're on his fucking land. What, what's the plan today? Uh, so I brought some guns and I know you boys. So I thought I'd bring out some, some big ones. We brought, a, we brought a Barrett 50 cal. All my all my guns are suppressed as well. I'll show you guys will never They're see. They're all silenced? Yeah, except for Damn. the only one that's not as much uh, my Desert Eagle. Let's go. I'm in. How much does a sniper like this cost? 20 grand. This is pretty fucking cool. It's very cool. Oh, this is like literally like a fucking cool dude. Fuck those, Fucking drop shot. <laughs> a Kimbo, bro. So this is the explosive stuff? Yes, but we've got 30 pounds of that. These are like literal legal explosives. You can buy these at Dick's Sporting Goods here in Texas. They definitely don't sell this okay. in California. <laughs> it should disintegrate the car. Let's get some guns out. I'm a COD veteran. Man, I can't believe you we boys haven't done this. You guys do some fucking wild shit. Yeah, we don't do shit like this. This is like this is pretty normal for Texas boys like you. That's fucking awesome. Oh my god, this is so cool! <laughs> Kyle, get over here, shoot this yeah. fucking thing! Holy fuck! Oh my god. one. Whoa! Holy fuck! That's fucked! Well, you guys have one of those guns. I don't know what it's called, but it's like this, and you like, pop. Fucking bazooka? Yeah, bazooka. No, 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 no. I wish I fucking had this. This is like GTA. This is Texas. <laughs> you guys are up for a nugget. <laughs> Listen, boys, if you're under the age of seven, don't get into long cut, don't get into red men. Just choose straight if you're under seven, all right? I don't want you kids fucking up your lives. Don't do coke till you're at least 14. Fuck it, I'll pack one. Boy, look like a fucking chipmunk. Throw it in. There you go, boy. How does it feel? <laughs> yeah, we shoot pigs. You know, we slice them open, we cut them up. We can eat them if you want. Yeah, we. We do it all out here in Texas. This is cool. Damn. Oh, Let's fucking shit. go. I was just seeing if it's, it's safe to shoot back there because the road going there, this, this round could travel like two uh, miles. Yeah, just make sure you hit at least the dirt and we're golden. <laughs> I've never shot a fucking. Oh, okay. So we yeah. might want to adjust the fucking truck. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. 45 pounds in this one, I think. A Tannerite and five, five gallons of gasoline. Run it. I'm ready. I'm not ready. Three, two, one. Oh, 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 oh my god! Holy fuck! Holy fuck! Fuck yes, it fucking worked! Holy fuck! Fuck yes! Oh, that is what fuck. I'm talking about, baby. Let's go! Let's go, baby! Let's go. Oh! Yo, we got a fire! Oh fuck, there is a fire! Oh! Yo, that Dude, was, that was crazy! It's on the fucking phone with my mom. <laughs> It went off? First of all, let's just give a shout out to these two gentlemen who hit it. I don't know which one of them hit it on the first shot, but one of them did. It's a pretty good shot, 230 meters. Hey boys, yeah, don't wait up or anything, it's all good. We're fucking running around in the desert over here. Fucking kids. Not bad, not bad, boys. Is that a piece of the car that flew over there yeah, and landed? Yeah. Holy shit, dude, that was way more chaotic than I thought it would be. Some, look, the car yeah. flew over there. A little secondary fire. The fire is getting huge. We need to put it out. It is spreading. Yo, you need to get the bucket. Let's go. Stop the fire with our bare hands. If you guys ever fucking some some reason come to Cali, hit us up. Oh, I'm I'm always fucking down to do wild shit. Bring the guy. fucking guns. Yeah, bring the bear. <laughs> Whatever the fuck you want, <laughs> just fucking bring them. Fuck it. Holy. God fucking damn it, Alex. What I do? <laughs> Dude, I swear drinking a. A black fucking pike coffee from Starbucks is like drinking whiskey. I ain't no bitch, but it's fucking like, you know, in the morning. Fucking Chef TJ's got me on this diet. It's called zero calories. Yeah. Keeping it going. Be quiet. You ready? Uh, ready. <laughs> Slim, you're so new to the company, man. <laughs> Chewy, road trip. It's not a question. Get the fuck in the car. He hates cars, dude. He loves you. That's love. Is he actually just on me? Yeah. He's just chilling. Bye, Chewy. Buddy, what the fuck is that bag? 
It's a saddle. You mean a satchel? Satchel. I don't really still rock the fucking Gucci handbag Louis Vuitton shit. If you get a kill with that on, I'll fucking give you a grand. Oh, money on that. Money on. But you have to, you have to, I want to see you walk yeah. into the room with the bird with that on. Yes, a thousand dollars easily. I can get a kill with this. This is pretty Living easy. Like a race. Living like a race. Ain't no sign of stopping on my pace. I can see them plotting, it ain't safe. She know that I got it on the way. Told her get up on my face. <laughs> We're in New Orleans. Who goes to fucking New Orleans? What's not Mardi Gras? And there's a virus going around. I need a fucking better room than this. Yeah. Look at oh. this. Look what I have to do. I have to shut the door when I want to go to my living room. Look, I have my own kitchen. I have a legit apartment. Fuck that shit, huh? Yo, this is fresh. It's shit. Dude, you can let it jerk shit. off right here. Just don't put this on camera. I gotta go beat up one of our assistants now. What is this? And they have my fucking name on it? Like, what is it? Who is this shit, Alex? Yo, this is this is amazing. Let's see my place. I want to oh. see it. Ah! This is fresh. Let me let me think. Just imagine where you could put the cuffs at, and then oh, where, oh, your hands, yeah. where your hands. Oh, my. you could just be like this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Part two. <laughs> There's a lot of people there. Okay. All right. Uh, Kale invited us to a little fucking small town crawfish boil. I think it's like it's the whole fucking yeah. small town. Is broccoli here? Am I gonna eat good. Good. Asparagus is coming through late night, I heard. Let's go! In Louisiana with it! Let's go! Let's pop it, bro. Let's get it. Look, this is, look, I'm about to introduce you to this new house. There, I'm standing I'm back. Back. Oh, oh, oh. We, we raised this house. It used to be about where the, um, where the platform is at. Well, uh, even with the stairs, it was about eight foot off the ground. We raised it after the flood. That's crazy. It's pretty wild. Yeah. Why am I the one doing her? <laughs> oh, you put her on the cartilage, bud. <laughs> so this is jambalaya. Hey, y'all come eat this. Oh, shit. Just stick your hand in it. We're from Louisiana. We don't care. Oh, we're spreading it, yeah? Everyone just stick your hand in it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We haven't been here for more than 15 minutes. You have to take your shirt off? Buddy, you got to show the game. <laughs> He doesn't know to stop gassing and then turn. Let's go! Oh my god, well this this idiot's gonna get fucking hit. Oh, oh look at him! Yeah. Yo, watch out, he doesn't know how to ride it, right? Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Cousin Jay. He almost died. Guys, I thought it, I thought he was laying down there when I jumped, I and then when I got in, I was like, oh, fuck, he's yeah. right there. He does not give a fuck, boy. <laughs> All by my cheddar, my provolone. Cantankerous nigga from Orion Yonder. How was your night last night, buddy? <laughs> it was fun, bro. I wish we could all stay, but... We were in, like, we were at the party last night, and, like, you know, when those circles form, and, like, everyone's, like, doing that shit. I, I can't get in there. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't know. Brand new Lamborghini. Yeah. Good cop car. I'll never, I'll never be in one of those circles. I just, I don't have it, you know? Yeah, that's I wish, something. I wish I could, but I just, I can't do it, you know? Can we talk about the uh, dance on camera? And, uh... We can. I don't really like Sack, but that's one thing that I can take from Sack is a little, you know, we know how to... We know how to go crazy with our body, you know? <laughs> and we can pop it up right here. But basically, I was willing her. She was willing me the whole night, and we had a great time. You can never predict what this guy's gonna do. As soon as, as, soon as he came inside the party, he literally took off his shirt. He's about to jet ski with a mom. And he then, did jet ski with a mom. Yeah. She the one, she's the one who said, let's go jet ski. Did uh, she make a move or no? She didn't make a move. She did? No, no, no. Uh. Cousins the new Nino without the fucking creepiness. So uh, did you get a kill with that thing or no? Oh. So you owe him a thousand dollars. Look, okay, look, Florida, Florida. Okay. I will do you it. You have to keep Please. it on. I promise, I'll keep it on, Florida. The fuck's even in there? <laughs> Jot down notes. Oh, oh. diary okay. of a wimpy this kid. Deep. I got an iPhone eight, <laughs> an iPhone <laughs> six. <laughs> uh. I got 
my hair pick, and my toothbrush, <laughs> and I got my passport. Oh. You got a cooter in here. <laughs> oh shit. It's hard to do it, you gotta really. It's an art. So this is the plan. We are road tripping from New Orleans all the way to Florida. So we're gonna shoot an old school prank, pretending to be a Target employee, where we go into Targets. All the OGs already know, obviously, but uh, we got a bunch of name tags. I'll be Big D, Daniel. You'll be Leslie. <laughs> I'm Daniel O. You're just Daniel. Let's get the fuck out of here. We need to go. We actually need to go. I don't want to run because then I might get shot. But yeah, yeah, run, run, run. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Got some good clips. We gotta go. We gotta go. Let's go because they're looking right now. All right, and just like that, we're fucking on to the next state. Oh god. Oh, awesome. no. Fuck. Yep. We should record this, yeah? Yeah, yeah. How's it going, sir? Okay. Right here in the passenger seat. Stand on the right Can I unlock it from here? Yeah, you got it. Okay. Hey, how you doing? How's it going? Y'all would just put your hands right there on top of those seats for me, please. Y'all have ID on y'all? Yeah. Yeah. I need them. Who all went in the store? Yeah, I'm just like, oh, you? Okay. Come on out. Yeah. Whoever was in the store, come on out. Okay. Come on, step out. What, what are y'all doing over there? Yeah. They're trying to get in the back section of their store. Yeah, but they, and you're yeah. acting like Target employees. You're not. Uh, That's an issue. Okay, first time I'm coming to you guys. Please use it. That's the best thing at home. Just use 39. Let's just shut this door real quick. I'm going to give you your keys. Okay. okay. You want me to shut the door? I'll shut it. Sure. Now, y'all had, uh, who had the radios from Target? So boys, we're being escorted right now by the cops. They told us to follow them, so we're in like a police car sandwich. They're taking us to the station right now. We're not really sure what's gonna happen. The, the target lady citizens arrested us. That's what he said, so that's a new, uh, new one on the bucket list for the boys here. Arrested in fucking Mississippi, boys. Yeah, so if we can get arrested in Alabama and then Florida, that'd be perfect. Let's just fucking do it. We need to actually go to jail. That was bullshit. That was absolute fucking horseshit. They teased us. That was like a huge tease. Salim's a little shook, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Salim, you're shook? I was shook, but it's a great experience. This wasn't a prank this time, buddy. All right, boys. It wasn't just me that got fucking arrested. Fucking Adrian, Austin, Jay, Steve. Let's go. Salim, go. Dr. Ernie. Send you a shadow. We all got fucking locked up. The other boys were in the other cars, but I'm glad we're all safe. Yeah, shout out the whole fucking all the boys, man. We were a little scared there for a little bit. But we're good. What was your guys' thoughts about it? At first, I thought it was a prank, like honestly, and then and then it was like, okay, get out of the car, and it was like, holy shit, kind of fucked up. Now I pretty much fit my stereotype. I'm a criminal. <laughs> uh, the cops were super cool, but we got to pop up for court in a few months, and we'll keep you guys updated, man. We're gonna fucking roadie to Florida. We got seven hours. Are we just gonna send to Florida? Pop. Straight to Florida? Oh, yeah. Brand new way yeah. 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 Just joshing. I'ma spend this holiday locked in. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top 10.